Here are my ACC predictions, both for the Atlantic Division and the Coastal. The Atlantic, I know it sounds crazy, but I think NC State finishes first. Clemson at number two. Though I could see Clemson finishing first, it's just I have a question about quarterback play and their offense. You know, I'm not talking about like recruits. And I mean, like, because last year their offense was not that great. Wake Forest in number three, their defense just needs to improve. Just to even, those three are definitely the best teams in the ACC Atlantic. Louisville number five, Florida State. I'm at Louisville 4, Florida State 5, Syracuse 6, Boston College at number 7. Maybe all these can make a bowl game, but I for sure see at least 4 or 5 for sure. So, in Syracuse, it's kind of a tricky situation because... They need to make a bowl game this year to save you know Baber's job. But now for the ACC Coastal, Miami, Florida, number one, Pitt two. So the champ, ACC champ from last year, not I. That could very well finish first, but I just don't know because if they lose, they have a few toss-up games besides Miami, Florida other games Virginia 3 North Carolina 4 Virginia Tech 5 Georgia Tech 6 Duke 7 I would think at least 4 or for sure 3 teams making a bowl game this year but maybe even 4 at least 4 I don't know about Virginia Tech making a bowl they could make a bowl game but I don't know Georgia Tech needs to make a bowl game just to keep that coach's job just to keep his job on me. And I just don't think Duke is going to make a ball game, period. So, it's very, very interesting in a coastal. That is so wide open this year. I mean, it's always wide open. Because I think it's a three-team race. Virginia does have a really good quarterback, Brent Armstrong. So, you know. Anyways, if you like this content, hit the like and subscribe button. I see you guys later. It's going to be the point to subscribe some more by the end of this year.